basically, I'm in Cloverdale. I got a ride from an art, some from, edit this. What's up everybody? So I'm trying to hitchhike out of Cloverdale. Um, I got my stitches up in Garberville in the last episode. And in this episode, hopefully we get a ride. Um, I've been trying since about 6 a.m. this morning. Um, <laughs> anyways, uh, yeah, so I, I'm, I failed to mention before that uh, when I was in Garberville getting the stitches, I ended up getting a ride from uh, somebody that was from Argentina. She uh, was another traveler. She lived inside of, I think it was a Subaru, like hatchback kind of a car, one of the bigger ones that have the bigger backs. Um, but anyways, like she kind of knew I was like in this bad headspace. Um, and I just gone through that traumatizing event with the last ride. And uh, you know, all she did was spree preach positivity and I just I want to say thank you to her um, so Stephanie from Argentina if you ever see this video um, thank you so much you really helped me step into a positive headspace and thank you for the ride as well hopefully I can get out of uh, get out of here uh, Cloverdale is actually pretty hard to get out of um, but once I get past here I'm pretty sure I'll be able to you know, smooth sail, hopefully all the way east. I've never hitchhiked uh, the southern states going east, and this is going to be a, an adventure. So, hell yeah, man. Uh, so, I guess, uh, yeah, I'm going to listen to some music, and I'll let you guys know whenever I get a ride. I just wanted to let you guys know I love my babies, and they're going to be taken care of in this long journey across the United States. They are first. Huh, girls? Yeah, because this is your adventure. That's right. All right, guys, I got a ride from Cloverdale to Santa Rosa. Um, I will see you guys at Santa Rosa Mall. Alright, what's up everybody? So I'm here in Santa Rosa and I'm sitting here with uh, Gary Gray. And Gary Gray, what, what do you got to say to the world, man? What? What do you, what do you got to say to the world? Well, I got to say to the world that it's a shame that the hippies died too soon. Alright. What, what makes you that say the that? good love and peace and the free love died a little too soon. But I got a bunch of it. You think it'll come back? Pardon? You think it'll come back? Nah, not like that. But I lived in the Haight Ashbury on Haight Street. If you could give one piece of advice to the younger generations, what would you say? Let's see, stay off the crack. All right. Yeah. <laughs> That's it? Uh, stay off the crack, man. <laughs> Jeez. All right. You know, in my life, still taping. Uh, that was the worst uh, epidemic that we had. Probably worse than the, what's the one going on now? Yeah. yeah. I'll have to bleep that uh, out because... I, I think we lost a lot more people on, 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 on stupid drugs. Like That's right. Man. Not second else. It's, it's true. Long. And now we have to deal with the fentanyl crisis. Right. I've been in county jail for a year. All right, YouTube. So basically, as I said in the last video, for every like that I got, I was going to put that in dollars and give it to the next person that was in my video. So I only got 10 likes on my last video, and that's 10 bucks is yours. So here you go. Just take the money. Well, I do. It's 10 bucks. It'll buy you coffee. And it pays you for your... No. For your kind you words to the younger clip, generation. Then you promise to use my clip. I'll to, use the clip. To, to college radio, right? You, you're not on the regular radio, are you? No. <laughs> you, 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 Don't you, spend that on beer. No. Oh. <laughs> you know what? If I, you, was, if I was thinking about buy some food. going to find one of this girl down the street. Okay, there. okay. Alright, so.
so since I'm going to the East Coast, I decided I would get Mexican food. I'm not sure how much Mexican food they have over there on the East Coast in Florida. Check out this burrito. It looks fantastic. There's the inside, it looks so good. I got carne asada, just a normal burrito. But I decided to add guacamole. Honey's just waiting for cookies. <laughs> you gotta treat yourself every once in a while, man. I don't normally eat my uh, <clears throat> burritos with a fork, but this is a special burrito. It's pretty big. And they gave me a fork, so I'm using it. This burrito is definitely uh, amazing. I don't know the name of the spot, but it's right next to the transit station in uh, Santa Rosa. Yeah, I already ordered myself another soda. So what I do to cut myself off is I'll, I'll ask for the bill, which I just did. Otherwise, I'll sit here, order dessert, order three, four more drinks, order more chips. You gotta treat yourself, but be thrifty at the same time. This food looks great on camera, too. <laughs> Here, Indica. to Petaluma. Get the ball. Go get it. Go get it. Go get it. Go on. Go on, it's okay. Come on. Come on, come get it. Annika, come get the ball. Come get it. Get the ball. All right. So right now the dogs and I are in the North Bay area. Our last place we were at was... Um, Petaluma, I think it was. Um, right now, we are in a rough spot. I'm, I'm sitting right next to San Quentin, the, the prison. And literally, I tried all day yesterday to get a ride um, to no luck. And so I walked three, four miles, a few exits back north. Hopefully, I'll be able to catch her right here. Um, what do you think, honey? You think we got this? Yeah? I think we're gonna sit here for a while in the shade and let the dogs recuperate, and then uh, we're gonna get back on the road. Hopefully, hopefully I get a ride. Um, I want nothing more than just to get out of California. And I think once that happens, I won't even care where I am, what time I'm there. Um, I hope I hope I don't get in caught in any negative weather, like too cold or too hot, but. For the most part, I just want to get out of California. I want to go. Uh, I want to go make my way east. And I feel like I. I haven't really started. I won't feel like I've started until I've left California because, you know, this is. I've seen all of this a thousand times. So it's time to go see something new. And yee! But as you can see, before I shut this off. There's a lot of cars on this road and they're all going towards the 101 exit and that's what we need. Um, I just hope that some people are getting off the exit down there as well and getting gas or something. That's what I look for when I'm hitchhiking is gas uh, convenient for travelers. 
Um, so yeah. Indica! I love you! Alright, I'm at the bus stop in San Francisco. I got dropped off in the middle of the city and you don't hitch out of San Fran. You take the bus out. Ain't nobody gonna stop for you here. Just got off the bus in Chinatown. I'm gonna walk to the train. I don't think I've ever been here before, to be honest. The dogs are sleeping. Thank you. Be like water. Full people. Alright, I need to eat, so I'm gonna get some Starbucks. I love the chicken bacon. Hopefully they got some more of those. Still, it's like one o'clock. Let's go. All right, I got myself a white chocolate mocha. Grande. And I got myself two chicken bakes. Now, if you guys haven't tried the chicken bacon, Sitting in between commercial and uh, store.
I made it to Morgan Hill, southern San Jose, basically outside of San Jose at this point. Um, beautiful sunset behind me. Beautiful pink skies, blue sky. Um, yeah, you know, today I just, I thought I wasn't going to make it this far. I thought for some reason I was going to be trapped in the city. But I just kept pushing and I didn't give up and I made it out of the city which makes me really happy because I didn't want to have to sleep in San Francisco or San Jose. So it feels good to be on the outskirts of the outskirts of San Jose and yeah let's go find somewhere to camp. Hi girls, you going night night? No? You want to keep adventure? You want to go night night? Yeah. Alright, that's it for for now. I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, if you could please leave me a comment and a like. That helps me push the video out into the algorithm. Oh, I'm ready for bed. I don't know where I'm going to sleep. That'll probably be the final clip of this video is wherever I'm sleeping at. But I just got out of Walmart. I need to get some dog food. And uh, a gallon of water. Got myself a little candy bar, and a little smoothie. It's a naked orange vanilla cream. So, hell yeah. Um, yeah, man. Pretty stoked, pretty tired. Um, thank you guys for watching. Peace out.